Catholic education, camaraderie, and prayer. The annual Angelus Press Conference offers a rejuvenating three-day weekend complete with lectures, socializing, and the liturgy. This year's focus was on the Catholic family. This year's conference is on the family and it matters because it's very pertinent to us in our current situation as you know, a very young family and also because of the things going on socially today. From principles to practical tips, the conferences gave each listener a depth of knowledge on the topic of the family. My talk was the first talk of this Angelus Press Conference and the purpose was to give an introduction on the nature of marriage. We have a hard time in our world knowing what father, mother, affection, discipline, respect mean. So we need a model. And the model that I propose is the church who forms and loves souls. The fundamental message of, of my talk at this conference is a response to modern attacks on, on the family. And so it's a giving an apologetical approach to, to answering people who hold a positions contrary to the, the Catholic positions on the family and on marriage. My talk at the Angelus Press Conference was to express how the school is meant to help families in the work of restoration and I looked to the Benedictine uh, inspiration, in fact, holding this notion of all the world um, with degrees of sacredness in order to help instill in them this love of the beauty of, of Christian culture. So my talk at the conference was about courtship and preparation for marriage. I wanted the young people, especially listening to the talk, to know what is expected of them during their courtship, during the period in which they're preparing for marriage. My talk concentrated in the definition and in the ends of marriage and amplified catechism on the essential duties of the spouses, on the, on the bond that must exist in the spouses, the reason for that bond and how that bond builds up so the civil society and the ecclesiastical society. Here you can come to the conference and learn what it is that you really ought to do. And then when you return home, you're going to try and act in accordance with that. And you'll be subjected to all kinds of reminders about how you're different. So I was trying to describe how Catholic families go about living their lives based on the knowledge that they acquire at a conference like this. My conference was how to foster vocations within the family. What parents should know what was she should do in order to have vocations among their children. My talk concerned the domestic church, which is a mysterious term for some. Uh, we could call it the church of the home. In it, I address the uh, church as the model for families and um, encourage families to live the liturgical prayer even within the home. If I were to describe briefly what the fundamental message of my talk was, is that the only way that you can have a rich civilization is to have a civilization which is focused on Christ. And this focus on Christ and all that flows from it is something in which historically the church has demonstrated that marriage and family plays a fundamental role. So my talk is about Louis and Zelie Martin, who were the parents of St. Therese the Little Flower. So the talk is an examination of their lives and trying to draw some lessons for us today. There is nothing more important for both civil and Catholic society than their fundamental building block, the family. For those that missed the crucial guidance of these talks, Angelus Press has created a comprehensive collection of these conferences on CD. It's really important, I think, as traditional Catholics in this world today to keep that spirit. And it's very positive to see we're not in this alone. We're all here for common purpose and not to give up. I've been going to business conferences all over the country for years. And really, the Angelus Press Conference is of the caliber of some of the best conferences uh, that I've been to um, over the years. So really, really impressed. Angelus Press 
is a premier traditional Catholic publishing house in America. Serving the clergy, missions, schools, bookstores, and individual needs, Angelus Press is dedicated to furthering the mission of an integrated Catholic life. Each year's talks are available on angeluspress.org.